first off, I want to start out with grip it and rip it. Um, I don't know if that <laughs> sounded good at all because it did not seem like a great one, but hey. Um, of course, the second I hit like go live, uh, my tummy started acting up. So that's cool and fun, but it's fine because we're here and we're going to do a stream of some length. Um, I don't, I don't know how, how long I'm going to stream. Could be a short one, could be a long one, who knows? Uh, <laughs> but we're here and we're doing it and I'm very excited. Um, we're playing a game called The Signifier today and it's one that, uh, the resident Odd Moose, Allie, Allie got for me. Allie, Allie. I, <laughs> I don't know how to fucking talk right now, man. Um... But yeah, Allie picked it up for me, uh, and so you know the, the general assumption is it's a, it's a good one, um, but we'll see. Uh, it's uh, I know very little about it. I know that it's uh, you're like investigating a murder or a death. I should say I don't know if it's murder. Someone died, and you have to you have to investigate. But it looks real neat, so you know. There we go. Um... Hope y'all are doing great. It's, what is today, Wednesday? <laughs> it's Wednesday, my dudes. Um, my entire week has like been thrown off with like not having to work on Monday. Um, so I barely know what's happening anymore right now. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, but uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I guess I do have, I have this sweet little boy. Say little. He's very large, actually. My Wally darling came in, and I love him, and he's perfect, and he's so soft. And look at just look at how happy this lad is. Look at these little little hearts on the bottoms of his shoes. He's very cute, and I love him. He's just the most. Um. No, he's absolutely delightful and adorable, and I love him. And he gets to sit on the top of the pile. <laughs> You know, when I first started buying plushies for Makeship, um, it was just, it was not, I don't want to say it was a joke, uh, but it was definitely one of those like, oh, that'd be kind of neat because it was, it was with this lad. It was with Masky <laughs> uh, that I found out about them. And, you know, I love me some Marble Hornets. And so I was like, oh, that'd be kind of cool. And then everyone jumped on and, and started using Makeship to make all these things that I wanted. Because we got, we got, we got Masky. Uh, we got Wayne. Wayne was a makeshift. Um, we've got Shinji. And now we've got now we got Wally Darling. And I love him. Um Yeah, I don't know. I was very excited that he came in today. I've been waiting for him for the like the last like week and a half or so. Um and didn't like actually expect him to, to be in as quick as he, he was. Uh which was a a very lovely surprise. Um Yeah, I don't know. He's there. My boy. All of my lovely boys. <laughs> They're all there. Uh, yeah. So he's just gonna sit in the background. And it's gonna be nice. Uh, but yeah. We're gonna do a dang video game. Do I wanna be there? Do I wanna be here? I think I wanna be here. I do need to turn the sound back on. Um, I have over the last while just let the, like, menu noise play for when I start stream, but uh, the menu music sounds is just this horrible low droning. <laughs> and I was like, if I have to sit here for five minutes and just listen to this, I am going to explode. I'm sorry, let me just like slather my mouth with some aquaphor. <laughs> That I desperately need to get more of because there's like none left in there. Um, it's been so dang dry. Uh, and even with my humidifier running most of the time. This is not a pipe, is the name of chapter one. AI research, the influence of social media and brain scanning technology have led to three important developments. The creation of the TSB. Technology Safeguard Bureau, whose mission is to maintain democratic structures safe from the abuse of technology. 
complex international brain scanning regulations that protect private data, the undeniable tension between the world's biggest economies in the wake of new AI breakthroughs. Not AI, oh no. <laughs> Under this context, the Dreamwalker Project, which performs academic research on the human mind through AI-assisted brain scanning technology, has been under scrutiny. We had to make a collaborative deal with the new TSB to keep your research alive. Not all AI is bad. Please sign right here. Let me take a picture of you with the box. Do picture. I have to? Why? It's part of the protocol. Oh. Okay. I don't need to remind you how sensitive okay. the material is. I know. Fucking Please. hell, that's loud. Take care. Hold on. We're gonna... I had turned it down. Already. We'll just turn it down even more. Is that... Better? Those footsteps look like they're very loud. Which I know is a very funny thing to say, but... You know. OBS stuff. <laughs> um... Russell. Receive it? It just arrived. Good. Listen, priority is the Hold on. Hold on. Is there a way to turn the sensitivity up? Camera speed? Find the real cause of death. That's better. Reports indicate suicide. Oh. Drug overdose. Okay. But I don't buy it. It doesn't make sense. She's too important. Her timing was off. She was a lawyer at Bill AT, right? Like it's, this is president. this is not a pipe. Oh. That's different. <laughs> it yeah. looks like a pipe to me. Um, You're putting me in a tough spot here, Tom. Tom, how could you do this? Just make sure nothing leaks out. Why not wait for the full autopsy? Why do you need me? We need to move faster, and if there's something, why do you need going me? On, we need to investigate. This is a one-time chance to catch them. Go AT has been dodging us for way too long. So you want I'm sorry. Their name is Goat. <laughs> to find out how she died, which is legal. But if I'm right, it will take us some time. I can. Sorry, Tom was Remember, very quiet. These people were here in the first place. Well, we don't know anything yet. We will, we Russell. Know. I've been in this for too long to know it's not. If that is stuff. too loud at see. any point, I'll please let me know. Her apartment on Stratford Avenue. They're about to wrap it up over there. But Detective Stan Becker's waiting for you. He knows you're coming. If you want to investigate the real place, you should head out there now. All right, I'll check it out. Okay then, I'll leave you to it. Okay, don't keep but Stan waiting, and keep me posted on anything you find. But sure. Tom. See ya. There's so many things to look at. I don't like to read this nonsense. I never figured out how such a great scientist was able to pour so much time in reading clickbait articles. <laughs> he once said he could draw global connections through them. You're, you're talking a lot. I am being sued for my baby! CRISPR enhanced people have copyrighted genes added to their DNA. Oh no. Well, that's <laughs> not great. Here at the letter, we've learned to expect the unexpected because something new will always turn up. According to our sources, patients that underwent the medical trials for the ex 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 exogen? I don't know how you want to say that. Uh, exogen is what I am landing on. Let me just put my headphones on real funny, just so I can get my hair out of my face real fast. Uh, medical trials for the exogen treatment have uh, recently been contacted by their legal team and warned them that while their treatment covered... That while their treatment covered, any children from patients were not. That doesn't make any sense. I mean, I understand what they're trying to say, but not in the way that they've said it. Uh, this treatment directly affects the genetic material of the patients and scrubs them of possible genetic diseases. In the documents the letter has been able to obtain, there's also mention that in certain cases, the DNA strands passed on to offspring might also benefit from the use of exogen. With this information, we attempted to track down participants of... This is how we found Chris and L. Person. What a name. A pregnant couple who had signed up for the exogen trials due to this, uh, due to his proclivity to lung cancer and hers to glaucoma. Chris tells us, it's horrible. They own my reproductive organs. He probably said dick. Meanwhile, L. laughs when they called us. She says, and told us we could be liable. We just couldn't believe it. We barely have enough to scrape by. We can't afford, uh, afford lawyers or payments. Maybe, maybe born into debt. It's the stuff from dark sci-fi films. Monsters in the sky. Gene editing proteins and chemtrails. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Um. 
What's this? I really need a new partner. It's hard to replace Carl, though. <sighs> I really nope. need a new partner. Okay. Yep. Great. We have a we have a way to skip dialogue. Love that. <laughs> Can the skip skip dialogue option go away now? This was the first thing I brought in here. Illuminating. I can't believe the loss of performance after adapting them to comply with the new laws. Times are changing indeed. Sorry. Um. Uh, I did a bunch of laundry earlier today, and where I hang my laundry to dry, um, is like within eye view of uh, where I sit at the desk, and I have a hoodie on the very edge. So I put up the hood so that it doesn't get all scrunched and gross while it's drying and it looked like there was a person just standing there it gross. scared the shit out of me scanning and reconstructing real time the final <laughs> problem is head movement everything's too invasive okay i need to upload the digital brain first it should be in the box the brain disk should be in the box okay i uh like i said i don't i don't know much about this video game uh, other than Allie got it for me, and my little project. I trust Allie. Way. <laughs> Allie knows the things that I like, uh, and it did look kind of cool. So, not podcasts. Oh no! The end of subject. What is up with your arm, dude? Wait. Scientifically reproducible and proven behavior of the mind. All patterns laid out. Error-free simulations, bridging the worlds of psychology and science. The end of the spirit. Are we prepared for this? Of artificial, get all my professional life. Arcade. I never thought I did to I, see all this. I In also fact, want some Colin ice cream. Never actually How are you doing? How's it going? <laughs> nope. Let me make an analogy. Okay. Using quantum Can we? Theory. It's a good way to explain it. Okay, so... In quantum theory, you have all these equations to try I tried to, to exit and it wouldn't let me. But That's fine. The macroscopic world, you need another set of laws and theories, right? We don't have a unified Also, theory. why do I know this man's voice? Right. Not for lack of trying, pal. Needing yeah. to seize and not being able to is the you worst. Know, I'm sorry you're experiencing that. An interesting also, to understand the my stupid face is covering up. Extent. But unlike what happens in quantum theory okay. versus traditional just move down here for a minute faith in that we were ever going to bridge the cycle <laughs> thanks it's neuroscience we were very open <laughs> that in both cases we were treating the mind, but who would have thought a concept such as the unconscious would ever be seen through the realm of neuroscience and that the other core concepts of okay. cycle analysis me you're just you're just saying buzzwords the idea was an office lab hybrid okay sir Whatever you say. Um, you could build this in The Sims. <laughs> Will you, though? <gasps> the Mirror Stage. I know what this is. Uh, yeah, show me those subtitles, please. Uh, the Mirror Stage was one of the first concepts which Lacan worked on. At the beginning of his teaching in his essay, the Mirror Stage is a, for a formator of the function of the ego. Um, as it is revealed to us in the psychoanalytic experience, he based himself on the work of Henry Wallen on the pregnancy of the image Bro, of the image of the other's body for some species. Other's body. What the fuck? I can't understand anything right now. But also for the human baby. In relation to the image pregnancy, we have the notable example of Pigeon, whose development of the reproductive system would be intimately linked to the vision of their congeners. Isolated pigeons do not develop their gonads. Likewise, in the case of the human baby, the importance of the mirror, as well as the body and the words of others, is vital. Much of the image we have of ourselves depends on the other. Self would be a function that comes from the other. The experience of the child who still does not have a complete proprioception of his body due to the mature maturation of his nervous apparatus, who does not have a unitary idea of it, does not recognize himself in the mirror until he is more or less eight months old. Before that, his own image is to himself another being. In the mirror experience, um, do you can analyze it. That's a picture of a baby. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> um, where was I? <laughs> Thanks to the words of another who will confirm that that's you, the child will come to be recognized in his image. However, if we refl reflect on this scene of recognition, there is even 
filmic documentation of the moment when, with glee, but also with strangeness and amazement, the child recognizes himself for the first time in the mirror. It is still interesting to capture that before the child is able to articulate a word. The first thing that is placed is a you and not an I that captures the child in the image. That this is this is a lot. The main idea that Lacan transmitted in his sense, in this sense, and that made him generalize the stage of the mirror is something that always works beyond a certain stage in the child's development is that the function of the ego is something that is always being built on uh, in relation with others and takes as criteria the desirability of the social sphere, which is situated as the ideal images in a certain specific social and political context. Uh, further scientific analysis suggests that that is a picture of a baby who is happy. Also correct. <laughs> Ow, look at all y'all. Um... Neurotic conditions are, in this sense, related to the mirror function that fulfills the social context and especially the family. Neurotic conditions arise from the complex, problematic relationship that humans have with the desire of others. Fundamental question would be, what does the other want from me? Or what am I to the other? From J.P. Bustamante, function of the self in psychoanalyst, uh, psychoanalysis, excuse me. Uh, credible discover, Dr. Fruity. That's why you're on the team. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, I don't want to leave yet. Uh, I mean, I guess I do, because we want to get the stuff. Hello, lady. Nope, don't, don't want to put that down yet. Okay, that's fine. Can I pick that back up? Nope. All right. <laughs> Fucked that one up. Uh, Zoom? Joanna was the vice president at GOAT. It's GOAT. Joanna was the vice president at GOAT and one of the younger top executives in the technology industry. Known to be efficient, smart, ruthless, and determined, she has been credited as GOAT's highest valued asset in the last five years. With a strong understanding of management, laws, markets, and technology, she won the Inno Award in 2013, being the first woman in the world to receive it. Yeah, no lady pictures, only baby pictures. Let's, let's, get, let's get those babies back out here. <laughs> Uh, case information, high-profile executive found dead in an apartment. Parent drug overdose. Husband found her dead on August 29th, 3.15 p.m., called immediately at her own apartment, located at Jules Stranford Avenue 8542 Valley Tower, floor 42. Online life, Facebook, last post is from 2014. Twitter, last post is from 2016 about a conference she gave. Personal email is such. Corporate me email is such. Apparently... Mail has been deleted. Apparently due to corporate restrictions, Joanna didn't have an active online social life. Last known picture taken by Laura Paz, apparently her best friend, uh, two days before her death. August 29th? That's today. It's not today. We can pretend it's today. <laughs> My goodness. Uh, digital brain scan disc DBD. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, DB. That's that's not that's not what DBD means. Uh, this is the scan report though, so that's cool. Whoa! What is your hand doing? What is your hand doing, Russell? He's just he's just he's just doing this. Oh boy! Look at him go. Yeah, DBD report. You have to loop the killer. Oh, drop a pallet on that bad boy. <laughs> hey, I, I solved the look at the, the box uh, puzzle. Ooh, his hand. Oh my god. Do you want to cast 2009 before entering GOAT? Okay, well, I guess we'll go to her apartment then. So flexible. He should... Not be doing that. That can't be good for his wrists. <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> um. Oh, hey, a man with a face. Hi. Feel free to take a look around, but don't touch anything. Let me know if you have any questions. Bro, I'm gonna touch everything. <laughs> Here's the thing about me. <laughs> I will be touching Great Shaman po, everything. Great Shaman Poe, has passed away on his 100th birthday, dated July 12th. 
of the seer i don't think i ever heard of him okay as opposed to all the faceless men of slender variety listen we've not seen a single other dude i wasn't entirely sure uh that we were gonna see anyone else that's a domino's an actual brand <laughs> isn't it does that mean this moleo is also a a, a real brand last meal never collecting eight pages did you see that they like there's a, like a remaster of that game that came out like recently um in case you wanted to play it fruity because i know how much uh slender the eight pages is your favorite your last meal was just a plate <laughs> are you sure it's your favorite though why is he just why is he just hovering there oh god oh no no! We have no head! Also, our shoulder! We've been decaffeinated. Um. Can we look at that? Without. Oh god. Oh no. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Gale Technology stock drops 34 points. Automation global warming, the largest layoff causes. Economists call to avoid alarmism over possible economic downturn. No cap, no cap. Quite a view. Why are we back over here, Russell? Russell, what are you do? What are you doing, buddy? Go AT's new project. Why does he keep? Why do we keep going back there? Um, Go AT's Indie Tech Magazine, a hub for independent tech to show off their work. Translation, <laughs> a hub to check for new We were the faceless man the whole time, it's true. Growth. At least that's always been the trend with these companies. Um, I mean, we're gonna, we're gonna keep doing this, because I am interested. But... Aren't you going somewhere? We'll see if it, like, freaks out too much, uh, because... <laughs> Uh, that was a little scary. Why do I keep coming back here? Why? I'm not allowed to run, it seems. Every time I hit shift to run, which I know Russell can do, it just snaps me back to that table. Um, yeah, I've already broken the video game. Uh, my, my bad. Jesus. We need a prescription for most sleeping pills. Jesus. You can get. <laughs> okay, whatever Men's you say, clothes. Russell. Men's clothes. Men's clothes. Men's clothes. It looks like an expensive mask. I mean, listen. Weird place to store it. Is it though? Broken. Just broken. Clearly, she'd been drinking. Or just knocked over a bottle of whiskey that she was storing in here. I wonder what's in those boxes. What's in the box? In those boxes. Oh, okay. Uh. Uh. There's a lot of the bloody footprints None everywhere. I don't think it's a. Bloody <laughs> it's our head. Our head is in the box. She probably stepped on the broken shards. Bummer. And she got sick. Poor lady got sick. Okay. Uh, I think that's everything I can look at up here. We have it. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> well. Yeah. I guess that worked. Do uh, theories. Have any theories about what happened? It's a little early yet, but everything points to suicide. There are lots of loose ends as to why. Especially considering who she was. The laptop, for example, is gone. We have that hoodie keeps scaring it. me. So who knows how deep that thing goes. Even so, I don't think there's a possibility someone sneaked in and forced her to take some pills somehow. But don't take my word for it. We don't even have the full autopsy report yet. It's called the newspaper skip. It saves three seconds. I don't like it. I don't want to do the newspaper skip. <laughs> uh, about him? His name is Alex. Pretty average guy. Fitness trainer. The victim had kicked him out a few months ago. They were about to get a divorce. He came by to pick up some stuff he'd left here. Could he have been angry about the divorce? Yeah. If 
But as I said, she'd been dead for at least six hours before he got here. So if somehow he forced her to take an overdose... As far as you know. Yeah, he could have done it. You don't know. He could have been here before. What time did he come? The morning after. He called right away. The security cameras corroborate the time he arrived, so we don't have any reason to suspect him. Keep swapping between the two because they keep changing where the subtitles are supposed to be. Family? No, no children, no brothers or sisters. Foreign parents, if she didn't see much. For now, that's all I know. And a husband. Pretty regular corporate profile, if you ask me. Thanks. No problem. God, and even my captions are covering everything up. This sub-ideal. Okay. Is what we'll say. I think I have enough information from the real place. Time to find out what her memories have to say about what happened. <laughs> it's not really looking at us, but I respect his lack of eye contact. I do the same. Depends on the person. Sometimes I... Uh, sometimes I just stare too much. And other times I'm like, if I look at you, I will die. Uh, it's not really an in-between for me, personally. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh I mean... Huh. Well, it it teleported me back to Joanna's house. Uh <laughs> I don't know that I have like anything else lined up. Uh I literally I just can't run is is what's happening here. Oh boy. <laughs> I mean <laughs> this is an experience in and of itself. Upload is ready. <laughs> Seems like I I I'm scared to do it for too long, Seems I think. Ready? Yes. Okay, good. Please operate on patch 1.2. But we'll see. I don't understand why it keeps going back to that one spot. Understood. <laughs> it's because that's where we broke it. That's 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 the exact location where the first break occurred. Listen, I heard that this game was supposed to get real surreal at some point. Um, didn't expect it to to be immediately. <laughs> <laughs> so this is when she Wow. Oh, that's wild. Okay. Um That's kind of cool. Reconstructing glass from memories. I don't think we'll ever get it right. <laughs> Falling out of the map was a scripted event. Better dip in your hat to drop a player through the floor and out of the game of the first <laughs> first 30 minutes, TBH. <laughs> yeah. It's always gonna be a wild guess. Unless we start using discs instead of our brains. Oh, okay, Russell. <gasps> Ooh, Lady Shadow. Hello there, Joanna. What was in your mind when you looked at your shadow? <laughs> Horrible evil clock. Interesting glitch on the clock. Could be a filtering error. Could be a filtering oh, error. Okay. Afternoon light. Didn't you die at night? <laughs> this is my beautiful house. Yeah, the clock is definitely haunted. Um this is not my beautiful house. This is not my beautiful wife. Sorry, that looked like a thing for a second. Like a creature? Like some sort of animal? It looked like a horse for a moment. Um, okay. Uh, do we have any anything to... Lots of missing information here, Evie. This just doesn't seem to be the right moment. Yes. I wasn't able to pinpoint any further coordinates. Objective data is incomplete. Reasons? High emotional state. Hmm. What's in she here? Might have known she was going to die. Is there enough data to reconstruct a subjective state of the memory? Yes. Good. I'll enter the subjective state and see what I can find. Okay. Um. 
Whoa! Subjective reconstruction was successful, but I couldn't interpret all data. It's fine, Weebles. I don't think it is. Also, ladder? Even a special one like you. Is there, is there a better place for me to put my captions? Not really. That ladder goes down to the first floor. <laughs> you hitting that chocolate milk hard arcade? <laughs> That's how my home looks after good chocolate milk. Probably you should probably put it down. What? I can't make sense of this sound. I can't make sense of this sound. No, no is what it's saying. Hope that helps. Okay. Kind of weird and trippy it's the meow meow house absolutely <laughs> oh child could this be her as a child in the objective adult version of her isn't represented only her shadow could mean so many things looks like a girl i mean i think that's just you enforcing gender stereotypes onto this weird pixel child russell but what do i know i'm just one of them gays what is th what is this in the memory but i cannot interpret it i need to know what it is and where it belongs all right i'll study it and put it in the right place oh oh it's the clock Okay. Like, there? Okay, it's, I don't think it matters. Uh, pick it up. That's, that's definitely a clock, though. What do I know? I'm just one of them pixel childs. It's true. I am just one of them pixel childs. Ooh, what's this? Reminder. At your discretion, I can now eliminate processing power to deliver more accurate feedback. Processing. I can't interpret the new raw data, but the readings are the opposite of chaotic. They have a constant, rhythmic pattern. You can use the raw data interpretation interface to find where it might belong. I mean, here. Is that... How do I How do, I do that? Here? Do a match with clock data. Oh, okay. Okay. We just need it in the, the general location. It is a ladder now. Oh boy. Can I can I climb that? Is there anything in here? Hello? Oh, that's kind of cool. What's going on up here? Oh, puppy. Well, it's her dog. I'm mad that I'm not allowed to pet the dog. Okay. Her laptop. <laughs> yeah, can you imagine if home insurance like covered covered whatever is happening here? I'm gonna move my laundry real fast because this hoodie keeps scaring the bejesus out of me. Okay, that should be better. Yeah, it's just a regular t-shirt now. It does not look like a person looming in my doorway. What's this? Well, I just wanted to look at it. Is it a rose? Or is it a is it the mirror breaking? That's a 
floor. It did look like a flower. But that also... Looks like something shattering. Oops. I'm sorry, what is my me what is my pause menu now? Hi, Russell. Okay, this dang dog has got to stop barking at me. I'm nice, dog. Lure. Cobwabs. It is hard to tell. So, like, your little icon, if it's still the eye, the eye icon, if it is still lit up, there's more that our man has to say. Saw that in the hints. It is the mirror. Okay. Um, But sometimes it's hard to tell if it's lit up or grayed out. No mirror. Just because everything is so... This seems close. Maybe in the objective state. Okay, how do I go back? Just hold Q. Understood. Literally asking as I am doing it. Okay, I got you. Do a match right here with a mirror being violently broken. Oh. What is this hand doing here? All right now. Let's go home. Should be good enough evidence to keep him satisfied for now. Should I shut down the simulation? Please. No, but I want to look around more. Evie, no! Run. What's that? Okay. I mean, I guess we call Tom. We literally only have two contacts in our phone. I mean, this is from the person who only has, like, five, but, like... when she was lying on her bed and the pills were all over the floor so it seems you may be right there was definitely somebody with her a hand that's all you could find well tom i'm just getting started her last memories are fuzzy and that's probably because of the psychological stress she was under the fact uh -huh. that she wasn't alone is a good start yeah it's good to know but we need to know who it was so we can do something about it i'll keep looking tom let's just I'll hope keep the rest looking of tom in better shape i hope so did you find anything else? I saw a lot of other things. I, I just need to understand her unconscious better. It's fine, Russell. Just keep looking. But I need something else from you. We need to get into her I mean, I'm working on it, man. The password. We were able to hack the words, but there are three numbers. You blame the house? We have only a few shots of this. Considering how accurate you were with, uh... Oh, God. Uh... I mean... The password. I'd like to avoid that. Listen, Russell, we're here precisely to avoid tech industry fuck-ups like in the past. And finding the password is aligned with that goal. You're here because of that. My research had nothing to do with all of it. Russell, just send us the scan and inspection report as legally required, and there will be no issues, I promise. We're counting on you for this one. The password ends with NAMAS. N-A-M-A-H-S. But it's preceded by three numbers. We have three to four tries with this password at most. So when you have something, call me. It's not that simple. There are major consequences. I'll wait for your call. Bye, Russell. Damn it. They never listen. Um. Okay. I think it did just save, right? Let me, let me just triple check. Yeah, that's like two minutes ago. That was, that was before the Tom. Oh my god, it keeps not locking my cursor uh, when I go into the pause menu. What's in here? A lot of shutdowns lately. Building's electrical grid is oh, okay. Old. Um, so I got a backup. I I have no idea what I was trying to say. It's fine. Do we go back in? Okay, Evie. We need to find that <laughs> password. We go back in. But most importantly, how and why she died. If you can isolate memories or dreams that may have a connection with the password or emotional patterns similar to those of her death. A deep search is needed to find such patterns. It will take time. Yeah, I know. I could use some rest anyway. Understood. Search will run overnight. Optimize the processes as much as you can. Good night, Evie. Excuse Thank me. You. Good night. Good night, Evie. 
New location available. Home? Let's go home. <laughs> home sweet home. It's so dark here, Russell. The lights are pulsing, Russell. Reality home. This is the real Not home. Time. Oliver Sacks. Hallucinations. Never enough time. By Oliver Sacks. <gasps> I mean, it would be great if our home got to be silly willy, but I. I'm, I'm worried because it's very boring here. Ethical framework for the future. Um, oh, God. As AI, biotechnology, and other powerful discoveries change ourselves in the world, if body, mind, and social interaction enter the train of technological advancement, if technology goes faster than we can comprehend its effects on our civiliz civilization, it is time for us to better understand our shared human experience and build a future made for us instead of letting the future experiment on us and likely fail. We ought to talk about the opening, just how it's written, buddy. It is not good. Um, is a human experience a society itself built on the shoulders of a life-death cycle? If this were to change, what are we going to do to ensure peace? Are our minds, which evolved around the survival of small groups, prepared for mass information? How do we build communication that can handle these limitations? Are our instincts of empathy, which evolved to survive and procreate, prepared for extreme longevity? Will our worst instincts, which have sent us to the war for minimal physical differences or ideology, stand back when true physical change starts to happen and those changes pass on to the next generations? How do we avoid this? Oh, we're, do we're doing the wiggle thing over here. Oh, these are questions that we don't have an answer to yet. It's dangerous to ask them, but it's equally dangerous not to. Based on decades of studies about the human mind and putting our theories to test using revolutionary technology, we attempt to create an ethical framework for the future around that elusive question. What does it mean to be human? Uh, I keep hitting the wrong button. I'm sorry. Russell, every time you do that, I get scared that you're going to get stuck. Happens at home. Okay, okay. Uh, it's very dark. Do I have a... Carl. Hmm. I was going to ask if so I had a flashlight. A surprise. Russell. And now I can't look at anything. Right. No complaints. How about you? All good, all good, thank you. Happy to hear that. Hey, uh, I sent you an email. Okay. Yeah, I mean, for some reason I felt like I should call you. Nothing serious. Just wanted to call you personally and uh, tell you that. Well, More stuff about Lacan. Regardless of our professional differences, I'm still here. If you need me. I know you know that, but I felt like I wanted to make it clear. There's no need, Carl. I what know is you're good. madness? It's never been personal. You know that. I know. I just wanted to make sure you knew where I stood. How are things with the TSP, by the way? Yeah, stable, but. They gave me this new case, and they don't seem very eager to respect their own laws. Mm. Another murder? Yes. High-profile one. Go AT, no less. Yeah. Wait, can you even tell me this? You're under <coughs> the same contract as I am, Carl. Excuse me. Mm. I wonder if it will ever end. You should probably notify them. Yeah, you should, before they jump to conclusions. You're absolutely right. And how are you doing? Lots of change. House, work, people. Even this number will have to go. How secretive. Nah, it's just a tool. I won't lie that it feels good to have Kickstarter give a bit more funding, though. <laughs> you should try it one day. Mm. I bet it does. But you know... You gotta finish your work. Right? Anyway, Russell, I'm glad to hear that you're okay. Let's be in touch, alright? Make sure to check that email I sent you. Sure, I'll read it. Good. Bye, my friend. Be safe. You too, Carl. Take care. Sorry, I'm looking up who this voice actor is. Fuck. <laughs> it's, it's one of the boring men from Kingdom Hearts. Oh no. That's why I recognize it. Oh no! I hate that I recognized it! Um. 
okay, well, he's not one of the most boring men. Not one of the most boring voices, at least. Uh, he was Terra Xehanort and Ansem in Kingdom Hearts 3. Still pretty miserable, though. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking hell. Okay. Um, hold on, sorry, I'm, like, super sniffly because it's very cold. Yeah, his name is Fuck. How unfortunate. <laughs> Imagine naming your child Fuck. I can't see shit in here. After her mother died. Is that a picture of ladies? She blames me for not being close enough, I think. Russell, I can't see this. Especially during my wife's last days. Russell, it's too dark in here. Can I can I turn a light on? It started updating on its own, stuck at 99.9%. Why am I not so I mean, it's just stuck at 99. Um I don't know where you're getting that extra 9 from. No one's in my shower. Great. Russell, turn turn the lights on. Yeah, is this people? <laughs> hey. This is Marie Tsui's speech from receiving a UN award. It was about AI, the future, and its building's design. They seem to be already using it. She seems to be quite optimistic on what can be done. Uh, this line represents the life and subject lived and stored as memories on their brain up until it was scanned and saved on the brain disk. Different memories will appear as the Dreamwalker reconstructs them. Keep in mind that sometimes external information is needed to reconstruct an event. That's definitely not what this article says. Um, but that's what it pulls up for the subtitles. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Do you think Ellie got this for me because it's a buggy mess? <laughs> is that why? Is that why Allie got it for me? <laughs> <laughs> Does that ever end? I'm preparing my final work. Dragon experience. It's a framework for the future. All very wasteful. Very dumb. <laughs> well, technology has changed the world many times for good or bad. But you could say that we have adapted in a way. But can we adapt forever? Take the internet, for example. A great invention, even though it's presented some serious challenges to society. We're still alive. Now imagine For now. something as world-changing as the internet happened every year. Ali desires and chaos. Facts, though. Or technology to improve our brains. Maybe add general AI all in that same year. And perhaps a new type of bomb. Can we catch up and adapt fast enough? Or will we lose control and leave it all to chance? Or to a group of companies? Or maybe we'll create too much control and leave our fate in the hands of a few politicians. That's down to earth, I'd say. What do you think? <laughs> so what are our options? I think the scary thing is not knowing. We have to imagine that there's a powerful creature in front of us being fed by our creativity. It's not good, it's not evil. But once awakened, it will change our civilization forever. We just have to be ready. That's why we need to create a solid ethical framework for the things we want to protect. So the fabric of society doesn't break. Naive. Okay, about one particular scary technology. Now that we have such advanced brain scanning tech, do you have any hopes of outlasting AI? Or do the possibilities of that make you more worried? Um. I, I guess. Slowly, but I'm excited by the possibility. And what would you say is your biggest why? <coughs> This Sorry. Independent quest. I'm not sure. He wants everything. But why are you still using that voice for Eden? There are so many good ones in there. The fewer layers, the better. We don't need the emotional layer in the voice, do we? And why not? Wouldn't that make communication easier? No, it wouldn't. We've talked about this, Joshua. 
Getting things done between humans and understanding each other is hard enough already. Give me one good reason why I should add that to an AI assistant. What I need is her data expressed as rationally and plain as possible. Like an equation. This fantasy of human-like voices is just as stupid as it is dangerous. Excuse me? Nothing. Punch him. Punch Joshua. That's my that's my suggestion and contribution to this conversation. Shit fuck. Chapter two, the drive. Oh my God, I can see. Amazing. Okay, well, that's kind of covered up. <gasps> it's done. It's done updating. Carl's email, and of course, a podcast is included. Yeah, but I don't want to. Yeah, my I, I've tried to like turn off a filter before, like the profanity filter on my captions, and it just doesn't work. It just doesn't want me to say things. Yes, we were less than 15 people, I think. It was like uh, 30 years ago, a few months after the company started. And now you're head of technology. That's right. Amazing. So before I ask you how smart you gotta be to do that, tell me, how did you guys- I don't care. I don't- I, I'm here for, like, investigating. I'm not here for listening to a podcast. <laughs> Uh, dear friend, a few months have passed, and I feel we haven't had the chance to talk properly. Since it's been crazy months for me, and I have zero doubts that, uh, that for you as well. I'm writing this email because the distance doesn't feel right. Yeah, we might have had some differences, but I like to believe that we're still friends. Um, I respect your call, Russell. Forget what I said. I respect your drive to make it happen. Maybe you will. In fact, I'm sure you will, one way or the other. My suggestion? Follow the data. Let me or other peers challenge the conclusions. I also want the kid out, but I can't force it. Let me help you achieve it. Object objectivity may be possible after all, no matter how much I believe in it. Bottom line is, we might uh, be working on different approaches now, but we can still be there for each other. Personally, professionally, I'm here if you need me. Carl. Uh... PD. Did Goat con uh, contact you on that indie tech bullshit? Smells like no thank you. PD2. Uh, attaching a podcast. They talk about a letter I sent. Okay, well, I would like to not be here. Also, I figured out what's going on with our arm. It's just hair. <laughs> uh, when we were in the lab originally, it looked like his arm was, like, glowing. Um, like, I assumed... Not that I, like, thought there was gonna be, like, combat or anything like that, but, like, I thought it was, like... Like, a marker for, like, health or something. <laughs> nope, it's just hair. It's... Why are you mad? <laughs> a note from Laura. Hey, Dad, so here I am, crashing at your house again. I guess that makes you the winner of our last debate. Sorry, I wanted to call first, but it's been some rough days. And my cell phone's... My cell phone's dead. Hope you don't mind me staying for a few days. I waited for you... Uh, waited for you a few hours, but I really need to sleep now. Haven't slept for a while. I'll explain everything later. Laura. I see you. Laura. I wonder what she's up to. Well, she's currently sleeping. Still sleeping. <laughs> you were thinking trespass? No! <laughs> a little, this but no! <laughs> I don't think I recognize this one. <laughs> Look, it was just... There was... It was just weird, okay? Oh, we're, uh... It's it's the room now? But we're experiencing Silent Hill the room now? What's this? What is um... This place? What have you gotten me into, Tom? If it's true that you have her brain, be careful what you do with the information you extract. I think she was killed because of what she knew. And where does that leave you? I don't know who killed her or if she was killed at all, but I'll help you find answers. You need to expose everything. I can help you make a solid case. 
Uh, these pictures are from her cell phone. I'm trying to find connections, but these in particular make no sense. Perhaps you can help me find something about them. I'll call you when it's safe. And don't tell anyone about this. For your own sake. A friend. Okay. Well, thanks, friend. Uh, <laughs> cool. Cool, 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 cool. It's supposed to be fall. But is it? These are very silly notes. Um, I mean, we go back to uh, the lab, right? Come up to the lab and see what's on the slab. I see you, Shiver. With Antissa. Okay. Upload is ready. Hi, Evie. Before asking about the overnight scan, I need to get a letter scan. Anything you can find on it is useful. Understood. Please leave it in the scanning hardware, and I'll do my best. Her lab with lots of running space. Running space that I'm scared to use. Developing on the off chance that I fall through the fucking floor. Probably the most important update to date. <laughs> Carl's last contribution to the project. Um... I, I, I can't. Honestly, I would much rather, like, I appreciate the fact that they have, like, decent enough voice actors uh, for this. However, I need, if you're gonna make me, like, have a bunch of stuff. Simulating human choice based on raw memory data. Haven't been able to read it yet. Far off, but worth reading, according to Carl. Oh, okay. Um, If you're gonna make me, like, have to take in a lot of information reading it is going to work better for me <laughs> uh because if somebody just starts droning on and on and on about stuff i'm not okay. it's not that i'm not gonna listen it's this that i'm gonna right. have a very hard time it's listening urgent. understood also that is any fingerprints or any other clues you can extract that's a different page than we had before i have hardware limitations for most other tasks yeah i know I'll build a decent scanner soon. Meanwhile, I'm sure my little project can be of some use. I will try. That's all I ask. Okay. Nothing else to put in there for Sorry, me. Sorry, my shoulders have been very tight recently and it fucking sucks. <laughs> okay. So, anything interesting on the search last night? I found two parts of her lifeline that may help you but only one is fully reconstructed. This one is a childhood memory that seems to be connected not only to the password, but also to her adult life. The other one is a recurring dream that started about one month ago, virtually every night. I'll need to brute force my way to a reconstruction for this dream. I'll notify you when I have something that can be uploaded. Thanks, Evie. Upload the childhood memory in the meantime, and keep working on that dream. Evie. Please activate the control panel Carl was working on. It might be easier now that we have more than one memory available. Understood. And letter scan is in process. Nothing found yet. Thanks. Keep me posted. Wonderful. Uh, let's go to the new one. <laughs> oh boy! <coughs> I mean, we want to go to the objective state, right? Control panel 1.2 is activated. Evie, what song is this? Searching. I can't find a match in online databases. Okay. I don't know what song this is. Um. I don't know what song this is. Okay, that's fine. Uh. Yeah, as much as I'm like, you know, making fun of the game at the moment, it is kind of interesting. Maybe her parents? I am intrigued, at least. Um, there's just a couple of things where I'm like, oh, wish that was slightly different just for how my brain functions. What was this? Well, that's horrifying. Say, babe, I'm. Or I ordered some pizza. I I hate how that looks. A time warp. The control is near the door. Okay. 
<laughs> he moved like a Hi. cow. The control is near the door. Pizza, pizza, pizza. Oh god! He crinkle. Okay, I'm not. I understand that I'm supposed to like. I I assume at least that I'm supposed to move him around and like put him in the right spot, but I'm not. Sure, how? Also, why do you have so many laundry baskets? My goodness. I can't enter. It's like a black wall. I think that's because it is like a black wall. What are you looking at, Joanna? Another failed glass attempt. Although now it reaches further into its surroundings. Someone unreadable in the magic mirror show. Okay. <laughs> a toy dinosaur. <gasps> I know. In the middle of the bed. A toy dinosaur. Yeah. Children. Children. Is it something in the mirror? Glass, mirrors. So many old superstitions exist about them. They are so impossible to interpret subjectively. Another failed glass attempt. Okay, so that's there's nothing else there. Um Yeah, we. I mean, okay, so so we can see. I assume that's all of the things that we can unlock, right? So we found all the ones there. So let's go there to the subjective state. Just gotta wee whoop them a bit. It's true. Sometimes to understand the situation, you just gotta wee whoop a little. It's very important to. Homemade cookies. Does this just go on and on forever? What is that? Could be a defense mechanism. Most likely. In current patch, they are unfiltered by default. Are they using my behavior? Yes. Good. This will give them a much broader expression range. Thanks for the warning, though. But what... It seems to react to my behavior. So what if I do this? It happens only when I walk backwards. I should keep going like this. It is the kitchen squiggler, you're right. Oh, that's kind of cool though. <laughs> like it's a it's a neat mechanic. Have I... Have we done it? Are we doing it? Oh, I think I'm in a bad place now. Oh. Oh. Also, I got the, the achievement. Solve the kitchen puzzle. Oh boy, I solved it. Um, okay. Okay. <laughs> Desperate to enter. Someone's desperate to enter. Don't let him in. Okay. It seems slightly different than the last time I saw it. Well, yeah, it's it on. Slightly different than the last time I saw it. It's on the wrong wall. The room was is flipped. Okay, uh, we got some glitches. We got a kitchen. What is happening? A looping hallway is what was happening. Understood. 
And now we're in the trash man's house. Sometimes you just gotta dig through some trash. Just walk through it. Okay. What's this? No, 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 no. I want you. Dog? The path splits in two. I mean, we want to follow dog, right? We trust dog. Oh. Where are you going so sadly? Unreadable. Maybe in the objective state. Ooh, new objective state unlocked. Evie, isn't this body a little blown out of proportion for it being in the objective state? I mean, there he's are just, no errors in the simulation. He's just very he's large, actually. Margin? Zero point one one percent off, but valid thanks to accurate matches on its surroundings. Okay, still seems a bit too big. We'll have to review those algorithms soon. Understood. Who's to say this isn't just a very large man? <laughs> Listen. It's just a big the guy. Isn't in the objective state. Only a glitch here. Um. Sad that dog is glitching. One of them should be the mother. One of them should be the mother. I mean, it's 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 this one, right? She is the mom. Because we saw her earlier. Away food. That spaghetti looks wild. I like that it's backward spaghetti bolognese. <laughs> um, okay, is there anything else I can look at? Thought that was some Static breathing. TVs were quite hypnotic. Okay, is that all you have to say, bud? Oops. Missing one thing here. I don't know what. Oh, here we go. A bedtime story, maybe. Something about a dinosaur? Hey. I could swear it's slightly different from the last time I saw it. Well, yeah, it keeps getting more glitched out, my guy. Uh, oh, can't go that way. <laughs> All right. Um, well, that's everything there. I haven't found everything here, though. So maybe we go back there. Let me look around a little more. Because I did just kind of, like, go into the kitchen and go, Ooh, I want to do that. Is it the same entity from the kitchen? It doesn't okay. like it when I look at it. Same. Happy memories are always saved in a special way. I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you. You horrible butthole hand. Is it the same entity from the kitchen? <laughs> it doesn't like it when I look at it. Hey, that spoon's too big. Books. I wonder if there's some connection with that body I saw here. I wonder if there's some connection with that body I saw here. Hmm. Okay. Is that everything here? There's one more thing. That's the pizza. That's the the looping kitchen. Oh! Her own version of things. Such beautiful innocence. There's also that spoon again orbiting the sun. Interesting. She likes spoons? Okay. Um. Sorry, I'm going to try the, the walk backwards through here thing again, and that's not going to work. Is it so. The same entity from the kitchen? We have located. Like 
all of the things here. Uh, so let's go here. And this time we go through the right path, right? Because we followed dog last time. Okay. Dog, where are you going? Evie, is there a reason the dog can enter there while I can't? It wasn't resolved as a neutral space. The coordinates are only for the dog, which is a Class D entity. Class D? Could it be made into an avatar? Am I gonna be dog? Done. Mapping behavior. Done. Processing. Avatar transform awaiting input. Oh! <gasps> be unpredictable. I'm gonna be the dog! I'm gonna be the dog! Also, Spoon. Are you watching TV? I am... I would have imagined the subjective static noise to be different at this age. Like little ants or something. Okay. Music's gone funky. It's the same music, but distorted. It's the same music... Okay. But distorted. What's this? Interesting shapes. Uh, we're just gonna check this real fast. I've not found everything. Hey, Keep it ready. Hey, Keep it ready. Is that everything? That is everything. Okay. Uh, let's become dog. I am dog. Bork bork. Oh god. How do we navigate the space though? Is the question. Is that not the space we look at? Yeah, how do I dog? Unreadable. Maybe in the objective state. Okay. Dog. I need help. Because I don't... Because that's a dead end. And I can't go backwards. So let's exit. How do we- oh wait. Am I- am I just here now? Oh god! I don't think that's supposed to happen. I don't think that's supposed to happen! Oh fuck, I don't think this is supposed to happen! Dog, how do we get out? Ugh. Well, this is where we came from. Okay, yeah, I'm not entirely sure how... how dog work. <laughs> This seems like the shadow of the people that were at the start of the memory. That's okay. Well, maybe we'll figure out Dog eventually. How do Pupper? That's just a hand. That's just a horrible hand from Elden Ring. Okay, well, we'll go look at the horrible hand in a minute. You just kind of want to see... What's here? Before we... Before we swap over. Is that a Matryoshka doll? And I'll, I'll look at you in a minute. Is that Joanna inside the frame? 
Why is this making horrible noises? Hi, buddy. Well, I don't want to I don't want to go in there. That seems not great. What am I supposed to do? That looks like the toy box. Dog! Dog, help! Dog, you're not helping. That behavior was extremely aggressive. Yes. I wonder what it's hiding. The path splits in two. Okay. Find what the hand slash spider is hiding. Great. Um... Hmm. There's one more thing in there that I haven't found, and I don't- I thought it was- I thought it was the... Um... Sorry, uh, I thought it was in Joanna's bedroom? Can I use dog? Dog, is this your spot? Will it let me go past? Did I do it? Another child's room. I think I did it. Uh, I can't look around. The dog projects a child's shadow. Maybe it's not a dog after all. The dog was also in her back memory, in the form of a picture. Exactly. Could there be a sister or a brother? I can look I now. By the detective that you need to name a child. I need to find out more about this room and this child. Okay, can I You again. You again. It's spoon. The dog projects a child's shadow. Okay. Maybe it's not a dog after all. I need to find out more about this room and this child. Is this is this the pizza call? That's the pizza, I think. Hello? Okay, uh, can I, I mean, we haven't explored that at all, but before we do, yeah, we must took a child for a dog. It happens to everybody. <laughs> Easy mistake. Filling this time warp with this data from start to end. Huh. Ordering food, it seems. 922 Plinth Street. Dinner bar. Interesting. I could check out the real place now. Okay, well, before we do, uh, I do want to go here to event four. I have to keep stretching in very strange, funny ways. Uh, because everything hurts. The weather's all funky. Joanna, is it you? Where are you going? And also, I've just been stressed, so I've been, you know, more tense. <laughs> it's fine. We're fine. Just means I gotta wiggle more. Okay. 
Okay, that's the same thing he's saying. Nothing in here. Can I, can I look at this? It's her getting a puppy. Yay! I'm missing one event, and, and it feels like it should be this, right? Probably need some data for it, huh? Okay, in that case... Can we... I mean, I guess we... Ask Evie? At this time, I don't have any useful feedback. Oh, okay. Uh, well, go back to the lab then. So we have a new location to visit. So let's go visit, because maybe that'll give us some information that we need. Laura. Hey, Dad. Sorry for crashing by without telling you my cell phone is dead. Is everything all right? Well, me and Chris had a fight, and. <sighs> Big yawns. I left him. Oh. Sorry to hear that. Yeah. You were right, of course. I was a thinking sleeper. Did you see my note? Uh. Yes. Yeah. I saw it. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dad. You were right. I hope you don't mind me staying a few days. As long as you need. No worries. Stay as long as you need to. I'll pick up some food on my way home. Thanks, Dad. Oh, I'll be going out with a friend tonight. And I promise I won't wake you up. It's just that we haven't seen each other for a while. I can't come in to talk to you. But we'll see each other tomorrow morning, probably. Yeah, sure. Great. Thanks, Dad. And I, I promise I won't be a nuisance. Don't, don't worry. worry. Talk to you soon, all right? Right. Sorry, Bye I didn't now. realize that Bye. by me just saying, yes, I, I read the note. It was going to be weird for everyone. <laughs> <coughs> but the other one just didn't feel right. Because I, I wanted to confirm for her that, yeah, I read it. That It's fine. <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to constantly apologize for coughing and, and stuff. Russell, You're just going to have to deal with that. Right now? <laughs> yes, right now. Just give me five um, minutes. I might be onto something here. I'll call you right back. Do it, but fast. It's again. It's it's less like a. Oh, I'm sorry that I am a human and I d do human things like cough. Uh, it's more that I I'm I'm just worried that it's very loud in the microphone even when I turn away from it. <laughs> <laughs> so it's more an apology of I'm sorry if that was loud. <laughs> no defense mechanisms to worry about. Oh, okay. <laughs> Those chimes are still hanging somewhere. Those chimes are still okay, hanging. Okay, still somewhere. just talking about the chimes. Understood. Um That's just this hallway. Also, this man needs to stop getting mad at me for, like, doing my job. Shit takes a while, okay? Okay, we want to go in here, right? This is the repressed room. That's what it was called when I got the achievement for going into it. Aww. So, Martha. Cat. A little <gasps> no, Martha. no, cat. Cat, 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 Dang, I can't believe Arcade thinks the room is ugly. <laughs> Bye, house and sis. Sorry for mom. Joanna. I like that that's Shaman Poe? Is that? Joanna and Miss Who? Uh... 
Okay, hold on. This is this is really cute though. Martha. It seems you were quite important in your sister's mind. What happened to you? I mean, she's probably fucking dead. Martha. Okay. okay. We'll just skip that. Is there something else that I need to like look at with this? It feels important, right? He's not saying anything about it. Martha turned into cats. The whole neighborhood feels abandoned. Yeah, but is it? The whole but is it? Also, what is what's the number here? Seventy. <laughs> Under seventy, excuse me. It's like sixty-five or something. <laughs> Um, which is unhelpful for this whole number situation that we have to figure out. <sighs> Do not rent. Those chimes are still hanging somewhere. Yeah, but they're not really helpful, are they, Russell? Fuck cops. Facts. Good graffiti. Um, can I leave? Can we leave? Used to be an innocent drawing. Oh. Used to be an innocent drawing. And now it's a dick. Uh, okay. Well, this wasn't like particularly helpful. Unless I can find where Cat went. Cat, are you over here? Come here. Chapter three: The Two Catalysts. Um. Yeah, Tom's gonna be fucking mad. Yes. Russell, we can't wait for the password anymore. Do you have it? I know I'm close. Just give me five minutes. Our window of time is closing. We haven't got five minutes. Just hurry. If you take any longer, we'll have to give it a shot on our own. Well, <laughs> is that my Nothing problem? To put in there for now. <laughs> I don't know what he wants from me. You know? Uh, okay, exit. Hi, Evie. Ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba. I can't find any patterns. I am limited by the hardware. Yeah. <laughs> Point taken. However, I was able to reconstruct the recurring dream I mentioned before. It oh, seems hey. to have started about 30 days before her death, with strongly repeating patterns. <sighs> it is available on the control panel. Good. Thanks. It is a very big toilet. Um, let me... Start that, and then hold on a second, I need to blow my nose. I am having trouble reconstructing time and perspective in this dream. How bad is it? I should be able to reconstruct all the events eventually, but their continuity oh boy. and the different dream perspectives are impossible. Please expect a few errors in continuity and perspective. Hey, thanks for meeting with me. Of course. We're friends. You seem quite upset. I was. Sorry about that. It, it's a long story. It's okay. What did you want to discover? Okay. Percent of dream reconstructed. <laughs> this dream reconstruction is really something special, Evie. As it is a dream, there are no filters for physical accuracy. Therefore, I know. It's easier to grasp the aesthetics of the imagination than the visual truth of memories. Precisely. 16% of dream reconstructed. Seems like a perspective error. It must match from somewhere. Oh, can I not? Okay. I was hoping that I could wiggle it around again. But that does not seem to be the case. Can I go in here? Ooh. 
Oh, and that did change the ladder. Okay. Is that... Can I climb that? Respective era. It must match from somewhere. Oh, oh. No. Where? Sorry, trying to figure out what it wants me to do, aside from just wiggle this around? When it says it must match from somewhere, do they mean I have to like be looking at it at a certain angle? Because like... I could climb that. <laughs> match from somewhere seems like a respective era it must match from somewhere where Russell would you like to give me a better idea of what you want also I had tried to walk through that before and it just did not work so that's cool. like like there Evie Try to reconstruct perspective from this angle, at the current time of the Listen, dream. Listen, I've been thinking a lot about the company and you leaving it. Did something happen? Well, no. Not yet, at least. Can you help me check on some files? It's not my area, and I just want a second opinion. I'm guessing classified. I'm still under your very unique contract, right? Yeah. I know it's a big ask. Okay. I like I like the idea, the execution, a little rough, but so far it it gives it gives me vibes from uh what was that Observer, um, was that one blooper team game with Rutger Hauer in it, uh that I ended up quitting because it was so fucking broken that I couldn't do anything with it, um. But, uh, 20% of dream reconstructed. Done in a way that's, like, actually good. This, this, that is, the signifier. Okay, where do I look at this from? There ish? Here? Please try to fix this perspective with the dream. But tell me, didn't your team of lawyers give you a legal adjustment? They did. There we go. This thing isn't even regulated. So you're safe on the legal end, but you're still worried and you're risking your job for me. Yeah, but you know how much pressure they're under. I just want to be sure. I don't feel like turning a blind eye to this. Feels different this time. Okay. And see, now that I know how the mechanic works, it's easy. It's very damp. <laughs> it's all just very slick. Um, I don't hate this. <laughs> Again, as much as I'm like goofing on it. Twenty-seven percent of dream reconstruction. It's neat. I like it. Curious as to where it's gonna go, cause you know. Could that be Joanna and Martha? Oh God! <laughs> what if we just don't look at the giant explosion? Oh, that's so bright. So that's the end of the dream. You seem worried about something that you mentioned. Hopefully, there's more information around. 
get a clearer picture of what caused this dream in the first place. Could that be Joanna Chandler? Okay. Trying to figure out like where where this starts, right? Hi, Varics. We're just we're just having weird dreams about things exploding. That's all. Am I supposed to be able to like figure it out from before this? Is that a thing? What is this? Those are just those are just floaties. Those are just things that float. You know. Floaty things. And it is now raining. Engineer. He's too young, too eager to prove himself. All right. Let me take a look. But I'll tell you that the way you described the guy reminds me of you a bit. Fair enough. What happened? You seem different. You mean I don't seem like the ruthless bitch that always gets her way? <laughs> We had our differences. <laughs> and I should have said that. <laughs> but I respect you. And I know that deep down... I don't care what you think of me. I really don't. But this is bigger than us. Will you help me? Sure. Just leave the files with me. And I'll let you know what I need. Okay. Um, is that still... Yeah, it's still kind of following me. That's fine. Oh. Oh. It's not anymore. What's over here? What is that? Oh, my boy doesn't want to run anymore. Okay, can we... Shift this, like... How do I get there? Can I not get there? That looks like a place that I should go to. <laughs> maybe I'm just... Maybe I'm just wrong. That's very possible. Um, in, in fact, incredibly likely. Is there something further up here? Okay, hold on. Hold on. I've made a terrible mistake. Can I not take this as far as it could go? Can I go over here? No, because that's still blocked by people, right? Also, there's an invisible wall that's not letting me go. <laughs> What's over here? That is getting louder. So is that... Is this where I needed to be? No. So I just need to keep following the lady. Is that what you want? No. Absolutely not. Okay. Sorry, I am a little lost now. Um, which is fine. Do I have everything here? No, there is one more thing. I mean, he said he wants to find the catalyst, right? Yeah, find the dream's catalyst. But I wouldn't necessarily find that in the dream, right? Could that be Joanna Chandler? Huh? Could that be Joanna? He's gonna he's just gonna keep asking me that huh I won't go any further than that is that because I am at the edge of of the dream exploding wait what's over here nothing that is nothing 
Can I? And I don't trust the lead engineer. He's too young. Oh god, I'm floating. To prove himself. All right. Okay, I think I need to. Do I need to like go all the way back towards the beginning and then explode everything? Fair enough. What happened? <laughs> I mean, I don't see. Bendy sequel looks great. I mean, doesn't take much to make that game good. The bar was pretty low. Knee slapper. I don't care what you think of me. I don't. I don't have great opinions of of Bendy. <laughs> I was not a fan. <laughs> As always, in enjoy enjoy what you enjoy. Um, that was definitely one that I was not particularly fond of. I tried the original and I got bored. We tried, Bernie and I tried, Dark Revival, uh, and I got mad because <laughs> I could not figure out that one stupid vent puzzle or whatever. I don't even remember what it was. I can't go back is the thing. Maybe I'm not grabbing it at the right time. Here? No, because that's, that's too high up now. It should be here, right? I should be able to cross back now. Okay, I can't. Um. <laughs> huh. Oh, I'm glad I'm your favorite knee slapper. Hey, got him. Uh, biggest gripe with Bendy is how everything looks the same. I get it's for the aesthetic, but also I don't think this kind of aesthetic was made for such a long game. Yeah, it's um. Sorry, I have to like sit, re reset myself down. <laughs> I like I like the aesthetic of it, um, but it does get very samey. <laughs> after a little bit um i think it worked better in the original game uh just because like they were episodic and they were a little shorter i didn't finish the original let me just put that out there i did like two chapters uh and then i was like okay i'm done gimmick is worn off on me i, I my for my general understanding of bendy is that it was made by a bunch of artists who didn't necessarily know how to make a game <laughs> Um, which is, like, on its own, not a bad thing. Um, but at, at, at the same time, um, maybe, maybe try and figure something out a, a little bit before you, uh, dive headfirst into something that that's, that's that ambitious. With at least, at least with, like, the Dark Revival, it was just so obviously, like, a Bioshock ripoff, right? They so badly just wanted to be Bioshock, and it's like, well, consider. I could just, I could just play Bioshock. <laughs> Is the thing about that situation. I just want to get back across, and I can't, and I don't know... What... The game wants for me in that regards. Okay, uh, zoom out. We were missing this bendy shock. <laughs> yeah, I think just like the fact that it is as long as it is, and that it is just so like literally, it is literally monotone, um, in in like its palette and its presentation that it does just get like real dull real fast right can i oh 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 wait no i didn't do that i did not cause that to happen that just happened um okay game i am a little little confused a little stuck how is this not the thing that i need to look at And the, the, the poster is gone. I've already looked at this child. Oh my god. Was that it? Horrible. 
Okay, well, at least we, we figured it out, right? Um, Evie? Processing. At this time, I don't have any useful feedback. Cool. Love that. <laughs> um... Okay, go back to the... Oh, wait, 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 wait. I could look at the raw data. I need to look at that. Do I have any? I think I've used all of them, but, like... I'm not... Sure. Here. No, it said th it was there. It was down in the bottom right, and now it's gone. Uh... I don't want to call either of these people. <laughs> Actually, uh, nothing else to put in there for now. Well, I know there's nothing else to put in there, and I don't want to read these. Upload is ready. Okay. Am I? Am I just an idiot? <laughs> Do I not know what's happening? I, I don't want to check in on Tom. He's going to yell at me that I don't have numbers yet. And I think that's a little rude of him. Um, I'm doing I'm doing what I can, you know? Uh, I don't really have much else to look at in the objective state. Why is that lit up? Why did that light up? Screen info? That's not, that's not what I need. Uh, oh. I'm missing something here. Hold on. Not that I think it's gonna, like, help this particular situation, but... Oh, this is where we saw the hand, right? Yeah, okay. What else am I missing, though? Uh... Mirror shards are making a trail to the bedroom. Is that it? No. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. The water is running. No. <laughs> uh, water is running. We know about a hand. Joanna, is this it? What happened to you? No. Okay. Uh, menacing hand. Still just a hand. Still just a hand. Is there something in the kitchen then? Oh, wait, no. So the laptop was here. She even took the time to write something. A few words. Not enough to make sense though. Okay, that is. Does Evie have anything to say now? Raw data. At this time, I don't have any use. Of course you don't, Evie. <laughs> Useless. Uh. Well, let's see. Oh nope, I meant to meant to turn that around. That didn't happen. This is her. Profile. Can I look at the scan report? <laughs> beep boop hang in there, champ beep. I I hate it. I, I Evie is useless. Okay, okay, let's actually look at this this time. It's a 2009. That's not a it's not three digits. We need three digits. Uh, uh, well, I guess we're hopping back in, huh? Well, if we're supposed to find, sorry, it still wants me to, like, have we tried zero, zero, zero? We have not. The thing is, we only have like four or five attempts on that, right? Which on its own is just very annoying. 
Um, and I can guarantee you, Tom has already tried a couple. And that's annoying of him. Does that ring? Are you kidding me? Does that ring? It is rain. Buddy, it is. I'm, I'm trying to wiggle time around and it's not letting me. How do we... Am I allowed to... Oh my god, I had to look at the rain before I could come up here? Unhappy. Dog! Another dog. As far as I know... Dog! Joanna didn't have a dog in her apartment. Someone else's, perhaps. Dog! Okay. Cabin, maybe. Did Joanna visit this place? Can we... Can you, can you send me back up? Or is this what I'm supposed to do? No. Uh. Okay, that was that was just a minute ago. Let's go. <laughs> uh, so that's twice twice now that we've fallen through the world. Yeah, it happened again. <laughs> Does that ring? Okay. But we know we know what we need to do to trigger this. And then we can get in here. I didn't think it was gonna let me fall, you know? And I assumed I needed to wiggle time back so that I could like see what had happened. This water must represent something. You look like my servers. Okay, well, we Wiggle the time back. Noises. There's steam coming out of that pipe. I should get closer. I mean, I'm working on it, buddy. I'm trying to get as close as I can. Joanna, what is this? I thought this place was the Maybe a deeper node of the drain? I have enough information to say that this is not your regular play. This is brand new to us. I know that. I just need to know the details. From the neutral perspective. It's just... I can't believe they've won its current state. But we have them breathing down our necks. We need to release before they keep pulling the laws out of... Look. I know their laws are like pulling a fly with a hammer. But this time, you may need them. You actually believe that? No, I think they're assholes, but you're not helping. You're creating that risk. Well, I'm worried too, am I not? Yeah, well, it's something. Richard, why is this different from the usual sermon about every other tech we've put out there? Here, let me show you. A new name in the puzzle. Richard. Richard. Can you find something on him, Evie? Searching. I mean, there's a lot of Richards in the world. She took to this Richard guy to see how safe it was. Chess. Apparently, the answer was enough to make her dream this every night until her death, worrying indeed. There are hundreds Joanna. of Richards that could be connected to Joanna somehow. Joanna. 29 of GoAP's current employees alone. And that is only from people that have their profiles public. <sighs> okay. Keep searching while I ask around. Okay. Um, we can go back to the lab. Because it told us we had to find that in reality. So we know now. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Where's my computer? Who is Richard? Parentheticals. <laughs> reality. <laughs> Sorry, it's, it's just very funny to me. Um, do I not have a computer here? That, that seems incorrect. Hello? <laughs> Mr. Russell, hi. My name is David. I'm calling on behalf of Marie Xu. Marie Xu? 
from Goy T? That's right, the CEO. Oh. Miss Shu would like to speak to you in person, Mr. Russell, at Goy T today. If Shu would like to speak to you in person. Well, sure, okay. Thank you for letting me know. I'll come by. Pooters is only for winners, and we are not a winner. Yeah, we're uh, we're not doing our greatest right now, huh? Thank you. Bye. Oh God! Everyone wants to talk to me. I want to go home so I can look at my computer there because we have a computer there. We know this. We know a computer exists in Russell's home. Um, and then after we do that, we might call it there because I'm I'm getting kind of hungry. Just kidding. This does not exist. Neural networks. An introduction to to design and development. The 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 design. <sighs> I'm gonna I'm gonna not keep trying that actually. Uh, yeah, we keep falling through the video game. Is part of the problem. <laughs> but also, I just like I, uh, I my my brain is starting to shut down. Uh, cause I need food. Oh boy. <sighs> Excuse me. We'll do this. What is this? I guess they use a lot of these to navigate inside the building. Oh! It's one of those hoverboards that the youths like. Hello? Mr. Russell, this is Mira. I'm Hello. Going to you. Um, oh, Miss I'm gonna Chu. eat food. I'm not gonna eat booter. I was notified of your arrival. I hope you had no trouble getting in. No. No. None at all. I'm very sorry for the short notice. And thank you for accepting our invitation. I'm happy to be here. Good. Robot. There's a lot to talk about. Listen, I'm on my way down. Please meet me on the middle bridge. Sure. So, how do I get there? Ah, please take the orange ring. The elevator on the right. Jess, please help me to that's, the bridge. That's because the elevator Jess, on the left the elevator has, the has robot in it. Down now. Meet me there. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Coffee zone. Two buildings, one focused mainly on research, and the other on business, both connected by bridges. Marie should be in the center. Weird. It is the automatic roof poker? I do kind of love this robot. TBH. <laughs> the orange building or the blue building, Neo? The choice is yours. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> oh boy. Uh. Who are you looking at? Oh, was that her? Hi, lady. Mr. Russell, we finally meet. Oh, that's a cool I wheelchair. You coming on like actually. <laughs> Miss Chu? You seem surprised. Her mouth is not moving. Sorry, I didn't know you were... Oh my god, Russell. ...without moving my lips? Yeah. Oh! Well, thanks to the amazing scientists in here, I can. I'm just... Oh! That's an actual... Okay. ...with these voices, but they're all still a bit off. My voice is more nerdy. This one feels wiser. And more... ...empowered somehow. <laughs> I guess we... I thought they just got lazy and didn't animate her mouth. I'm sorry, ma'am. It's interesting, though. After all these CEO videos, right? That's just called throwing your voice. <laughs> Come on. Talking somewhere. I guess that means you are really immersed in your own research. <laughs> I like that. I guess I am. Indeed. It took some time to reach you. You seem to be off the radar. Roomba. For the Roomba. Your research in the Let me look at the Roomba. I would have thought you were a ghost. Let me look at the Roomba. By today's social media. <sighs> Probably not a coincidence. It's too easy to get distracted these days. I just wanted to look at him. I actually find a lot of that in here. The need to focus. Everybody mm -hmm. is building something. They have a goal that is beyond traditional ambitions. It's a beautiful thing to be a part of. Please, mm. follow me. Okay, but can I look at the Roomba? You see, Mr. Russell. Roomba. Any good you're trying to do here oh. is in danger. If you look through these windows, you'll see the substance of what the future will be made of. I see a JPEG. Farming, clean energy development, <laughs> bold advancement in medicine. And here is our latest and most ambitious.
suspicious project. More JPEG. The first prototype of large scale AI designed automated construction. I don't know that I local uses. wanna trust AI to build buildings just yet. <laughs> Personally. Oh god, she's like stuttering when I walk. You see, Mr. Wisdom, someone like you could help us in this fight, both on the political and scientific front. One second, Mr. Wisdom. Yes. Can't it wait a few moments? I like your slippers. Hold the call. Weird that you're not wearing any socks with that, but hey. You already have self-crashing cars. The next step is to make them build skyscrapers. I should be ready in a few minutes. Jonas at I have more faith in an AI in an AI that's not built by Musk cronies. Uh but not not that much. Are we still talking? Do you want me to follow you? I can't. There is literally a wall keeping me from doing that. Okay. Can I? Please put your hand on the glass so we can look at clearance. Thanks. You're good to go. You can take that over there. Is is that here? Hey, that is here. Do these just know where I need to go? <laughs> Please, elevator. Why are you like this? What? What was I looking at? Goat. Push bar to open. Hi. You can find Miss Marie in her office. Okay. <gasps> Joanna. Can I? I can't go in. I'm not allowed to go in. What is that? Mr. Rotten, I'm glad you made it up here. I was just behind you. I, it's, I was not that far behind. Um, we were not separated from each other for that long. I wanted you to see it firsthand. There is ugly ass buildings. Our mission. The best way to break <gasps> is to talk face to face. Arcade was behind me. Little old me. There's no better PR than transparency. As long as it's managed. Can I sit down? I'm glad you understand. We have to be as open as we can while still remaining competitive. The Feminine Mystique is a book that I see up there. She's got the color purple. 1984? Animal Farm? Algorithms to live by. Creativity, Inc. Odd Liberty. Yes, they are. I hope they aren't being as obtrusive with you as they are with us. Who says elephants can't dance? Uh, if, if I, you okay. do everything by the book, there's nothing to hide. I like your zero to one. But I'm Isn't a that a disappoint you soon Ellis time. book? I do hope Ellis, I what is his name? Dude who did Russell, American Psychopath or American Psycho. The fourth industrial revolution. revolution. But on a different scale, we think a partnership would be very beneficial. What's his name? Uh, just what type? You mean a job here at GoAT? A job? No. A partnership. We're offering a very unique position here. A chance. Brett e Easton Ellis, Ellis, that's his name. Very generous resources and the power and freedom any smart scientist would ever want. Think no, I'm thinking of less than zero. Excuse me. Tech company with no connections to the pharmaceutical industry. I know that you already challenged their status quo and the effectiveness of their drugs. 
we can protect you from them and make your research widely known. The benefits of working together are limitless. Mm, I don't know that I trust these people. One is the share value of your expertise in the AI field, and the other is political support. A well-respected academic like you that has always been outside of the corporate world. That is what the public needs to see. So I'm skeptical. I would be a if for no other reason than it's a corporate, like a corporation, and fuck that. <laughs> Mm -hmm. is that together we can make the world a better place. Great minds like us need to unite and work Sapiens. together. Sapiens. And this is the place where you can achieve anything you set your mind to. The art Unless of the war. TSP gets in the way. Politics is the other part of the equation. I if trust you. Yeah. You would. Time comes, <laughs> everything will come down to ideology. I, I don't want you to be on the right side. Unless you think the TSB will avoid the upcoming problems by simply putting a lifetime break on every possible development. Uh. I mean, I don't want to be that person who's like, regulate everything! But like, also... The risk of stalling. A fair point, Mr. Edgar. If we don't... If, if there isn't it's some sort of... Side rains on things people are going to get hurt <laughs> i'm not saying that i don't know i don't know what i'm trying to say do you know there's a skybox outside your window right <laughs> ma'am i don't trust the government's intentions the law reacts and it's always late i understand you want to get ahead the stakes are too high a single mistake could cost the world everything on both sides is the thing they just want control. Oh boy! And God knows what they could do with what we create. They have their own agenda. God knows what you could do with what you create. Sorry. On paper, but in my opinion, that is not what's going on here. Besides, all these statesmen with their morals and their popular ideas. Sorry, I've watched Battlestar Galactica. I know what happens when you start making AI. The scientists, the inventors, the people who create things. They left us all the weight of their failures. So yes, I don't appreciate them breathing down my neck while we try to fix their mess. Anyway, Mr. Edgar, I don't want to keep you here for too long. And of course, you don't have to answer now. But I should tell you that given your opinions, I have no doubt that joining us would be the wise decision. <laughs> I appreciate the invitation, Miss Chu. But I'm afraid it's not what I'm looking for right now. I'm sad to hear that, Mr. Edgar. Still, the invitation is open. If you change your mind, please call if me. If it was a funny wibbly man in charge, I bet you'd agree with the Absolutely. <laughs> Throw Kaya's Baltar in there and I'd be like Thank you. I'll keep that in mind. I trust that guy. <laughs> that man who was clearly in the middle of his fourth breakdown of the day. I trust him. What other jobs can I give him? <laughs> I'd give him five more jobs. It's true. <laughs> Same hat. <laughs> oh my god. What news? Sorry. What news? Don't worry about it. Oh, I'm Mr. Russell. What news? Out of courtesy. We haven't signed NDAs or anything, but given the current situation, I would appreciate it if this offer remained between us, at least for now. Of course. No worries. Good. Let's keep it secret. As if it was a password. Weird way to say that, but okay. Amazing. Different seeds of the same building, all procedurally generated. This is an Edward Hopper, right? Indeed. I keep that painting there as a reminder of the problems of that time. How progress also brought loneliness and alienation. Okay. He expressed it so beautifully. It's a reminder of what we need to avoid in the next cycle. When technology once again changes the social fabric of the world, we cannot make the same mistakes. We must put ourselves first. I couldn't agree more. Oh, no, wait. Steps. 
I wasn't really listening to her, and then I didn't pay attention to the choices. Okay, I would like to not look at that anymore because I'm scared. Yes, a very sad moment for us all. She was an incredible professional and a great woman as well. I wish I had known what was happening in her mind. I guess I was too busy managing everything. What have you heard about her? I saw something on the news about her. Awful business. I imagine it must have been a terrible blow to everyone here. Indeed it was. I think she may have been contacted by the TSB. And who knows if they manipulated her. These people will do anything to fulfill their political agenda. Perhaps you can help us investigate things in the future. Find out how she really felt. Oh, wouldn't that be a cool thing for me to do? Uh, bye! <laughs> And Mr. Russell. Oh my god, how many just one more things are you gonna tell me? You've already we've already had this! We've already talked about this! God. Who's walking behind me? Who is stomping behind me? Let's keep it secret. As if it was a password. She asked for all these files. I have no idea. She did have access to everything. It's very technical stuff. Completely out of her area. It's like super complex. Hard to read even for me. And I'm an engineer. And the notes in these paragraphs. Unethical? Yeah. I think... Shh. Um... <laughs> Can I go in? Uh, okay. Well, you know... Ah, oh, fuck. I was hoping I could go behind the desk and, uh, poke around. Okay. Uh, can I just leave? Is it time to just leave? Also, I like how I told Tom just five more minutes. Twice now? Uh, and it's definitely been more than five minutes, and everything's fine, actually. Oh, maybe I spoke too soon. Russell. Hi, Tom. Hi. The password didn't work. Oh, damn. I thought I had it. And not only that, I didn't... we put our whole operation at risk. The attempts probably didn't go unnoticed. You know how it is. You can't compete with their infrastructure. You have to be very careful, Russell. There's a lot at stake here. Oh, you're the one who was rushing me. We can use. I thought your subjective approach would be more effective. It just needs time. Each person oh is goodness. like a small lab rat. I'm trying to get to the bottom of things. Well, I really hope you do. We don't want to pull the plug on you. <laughs> I'll get right on it. Do that. And I have a new task for you. Where are you right now? Oh. I, I don't trust shopping. any of these people. I'm tired of the same shirt. Hmm. You're funny, Mr. Russell. All right. Can you meet me? Well, maybe in an hour or so. After I'm done here. Okay. All right. Hey, but Tom, did you know you kind of suck? Something on the husband I don't like any of these people. I don't want to help any of them. Maybe he's afraid of something, or maybe he's just angry. In any case, if you give us some leverage on him, we might get him speaking. I have a feeling he knows more than you told us. I see. They can all go to the skybox. Too much, though. And of course, keep us out of it. I understand. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hey, Russell, don't fail us this time. And make sure to be transparent with everything. I'll be waiting for your call. Sure. Bye, Tom. Yeah, okay, weirdo. I mean, I'm gonna investigate, because I'm curious, but, like... <laughs> Fuck Tom. Um, let's just go back to the laboratory. And then we're gonna call it here, because, yeah, I need food. It's food time for me. <laughs> okay, let me exit out of the game. Um... Yeah, I don't know. We'll we'll consider playing more of this on stream. I don't know. I'm having a fun time with it. As silly as as it feels at times, um, but I'm kind of invested now. <laughs> so this might be our game for the time being um, on stream. But uh, for now, it's time for me to go get some food because I'm hungry. Um. See who is online at the moment. <gasps> Thanks for being here. Um. Yeah, it's weird and wiggly on the floor sometimes doesn't work, but I'm interested. Exactly. Like, 
Same, same though. <laughs> I want to know what's going on. Um, and we've started it, and like it's intriguing enough that even with like the bugs, uh, and and the issues, I'm I'm kind of like you know what we can we can just you know poke fun at it a little bit and then uh, continue on. Um, that's not how you spell raid. Uh, don't have too many people on right now. Uh, so I think we're just gonna go over to Super Great Friend. Uh, they're doing Overblood, which has been an experience. What was that? Um, I don't know. It's fine. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna go say hi to Super Great Friend. Uh, and, uh, do that. That's gonna be a thing that's happening. Um... Yeah, we'll see y'all. Overblood has been has been a hoot. Um, Friday, friend friend stream is gonna be on Fruity's channel, I believe. I think that was the plan. Uh, and I think we're gonna start a new Silent Hill this weekend. I think we're starting three. I think it's I think it's uh, Silent Hill three time this weekend. Yeah, it's you next. Hey, Fruity, it's you next. It's you next. Um, but that's just the general plan for the next few days. Uh, as always, we'll do Friend Friday on Friday as well. And, uh, yeah, that's all I've got. So we'll see you next time, pals. Bye!